I didn't have as much pressure as a lot of folks do when they're trying to do this to start off. That's where we got the ball rolling. Our, our initial goal is 150 rentals. Were you holding? Were you keeping? What was your plan all along? Did you decide you were going to keep doing the rentals, keep buying them and holding them? Or what was your, what was your strategy? At the point that we started the franchise, um, I had left my IT career um, really for more than anything needing flexibility because my kids had some health issues and had a lot of doctor's appointments and whatnot. Um, at that point, my goal, and I have a spreadsheet somewhere that has all the numbers, I went in and you can tell my details person, I said, okay, if I buy this many houses with this criteria each year, account for inflation, we're going to have this, I need 150 rentals. Mm -hmm. that's where I wanted to get to. And that was going to be my number based on that $200 a month um, of true cash flow, not, not gross cash flow. Yeah. Um, that's where we needed to be. Now to get there, I knew I was going to need to have another source of income, need to have some active income. And so that's where wholesaling and flipping came in. Amy, my wife still had a great job at that point. Um, she was still in corporate. So I had a, had a little bit of a cushion there. I didn't have as much pressure as a lot of folks do when they're trying to do this to start off. Sure. Um, but that's where we got the ball rolling. Our, our initial goal is 150 rentals. All right. So we're going to get, we're going to get here guys. So thank you for uh, trekking along with us on this journey. So your goal was 150 rentals, 200, $200 a month of cash flow. I did the math. We're sitting here and that's a pretty, it's a pretty exciting number. Um, in, in cash flow, right? So where, where are we to date? Um, we have about 130 rentals. Um, all right. They don't all cash flow 200. Some, some cash flow better, some not as sure. much. As we got more, I was able to kind of expand that, bo that buy box and have a little bit more um, variability with it. You know, buy some that don't cash flow as much now, but have the ability to cash flow better over time and more appreciation over time. Sure. Um, but we're at, I think 129 is where we're at now. That's impressive, man. Um, man, that that's, that's super impressive. 